Thank you for joining today's Words of Wisdom with Prayer. In the world, the war will uh, still continue uh, in the Russia and Ukraine. Uh, we feel very sorry about the people who are suffered from the war. So may God bless you. Okay, so uh, today, <clears throat> I would like to talk about these words of uh, wisdom with prayers. Do you take silent time in a day? Just I want to ask you about this question. Do you take silent or quiet time in a day? How about yesterday, the day or the, the day be before yesterday? Did you have uh, just one minute uh, of the quiet or silent time uh, with fearing the happiness? How is it? Please look back your day. Maybe uh, in this modern age, we have many convenient items. For example, smartphone, uh, PC, and in the smartphone or PC, we can use the apps, many apps. For example, the SNS, the Instagram, uh, Facebook, TikTok, uh, WhatsApp or Line, or we have many apps to connect with the people uh, in the world. So sometimes when you look back about your day, you don't have a time. You didn't have a time uh, with silent. From the morning, when you wake up, at that moment, you are going to use the smartphone and search anything on the SNS, and you are going to uh, change your clothes to go outside. And when you go outside, uh, on the way to go outside, you can use the smartphone and on the uh, train, bus, or car, it is easy to do something uh, with the smartphone. Or uh, when you go back to house, go back to go back home, at the time you can turn on the TV or you can turn on the uh, YouTube or uh, Netflix or Hulu or anything you can turn on easily and you can use the time and go to bed. Before you go to bed, you can use the smartphone. So every time or everywhere, we can use the smartphone and we can uh, search or we can waste, sometimes waste the time uh, on the SNS. It is very easy uh, for us. But uh, uh, of course, we, we, when we use the smartphone, we can get uh, happiness or we can get uh, feeling joy, uh, fun or something. But on the other hand, we can get the unhappiness or madness or angerness or sadness from the SNS, right? So today, I would like to ask you, please take a time, at least one minute. It is very easy to get the one minute for us uh, to but uh, I think it is not easy to use that one minute in siren. I think when we keep the siren in around 20 or 30 minutes, we want to use the small form easily. But try to take a one minute, at least one minute, uh, <clears throat> to think about your day or to think about your mind, or to think about others, that is, will make you the happiness in the future. Of course, you, can, you cannot get the instant happiness at that moment. I think you will think about, you will think about in this way, I cannot get the happiness 
uh, if we if I don't do anything or if I don't touch the smartphone. But that one minute will accumulate, accumulate to the happiness in the future. So please try to take the one minute to pray for your future, to pray for your happiness, or to pray for your healthy, or to pray for your uh, family, friends, or around you. It will be uh, changing your life. And at that moment, I think you can feel that some mysterical or wateriness uh, feeling. That is uh, the light from heavenly world, and that is light from the Lord God. So that is also, we can say, the gratitude from Lord God. Okay, so that gratitude will make you the eternal happiness. So even in this modern age, when we make, sorry, uh, even in this modern age, to make the silent or quiet time to look inside of us is very, very important time. So don't, don't think that is uh, no meaning or that is uh, just wasting time or something like this. Please think about that one minute or two minutes will make change your life. So from today, before going to bed, please take one minute quiet time to look back your day. That means that is one that is the teachings of self-reflection. So that is a, a practice of self-reflection. Okay. So uh, let's do it from today, and let's continue it tomorrow, the day after tomorrow, and one month, one year, or 10 years, or forever. Okay, so now let's recite Happy Science Prayers. Lord Elkantare, Mastari Ho Okawa, thank you very much for giving us your great light every day. We practice the principles of happiness, love, wisdom, self-reflection, and progress to make the world better with our brothers and sisters. With our gratitude, we will recite the true words spoken by Buddha. Prayer to the Lord and prayer to guardian and guiding spirits. The two words spoken by Buddha, Ryuho Okawa. There used to be the light in the great universe. The light is the energy of Buddha. People can live by this energy, and Buddha's energy has made human history. It will be supplied eternally. This eternal light comes from heaven and prevails on earth. This is the light of heaven. Through the prism of Buddha, there appear the seven colors of rainbow arching over in the sky. Here you can see Buddha's mercy. Yellow is the color of teaching. White is the color of saving. Red is the color of justice. Purple is the color of obedience. Blue is the color of thinking. Green is the color of harmony. Silver is the color of progress. These seven colors help each other, and there appears Buddha Land. Buddha Land is shining brightly. 
because of gathering of bodhisattvas. This is the land of love or the land of mercy. This is the land of wisdom or the land of teaching. Especially, this is the land of souls, rest in peace. Real souls are the children of Buddha. The children of Buddha became real human beings. Real human beings have spirituality. The spirits are immortal powers. The spirits are immortal forces. The spirits are real entities. The physical bodies are the shadows of the spirits. It means you are the boat sailing down the great river. The great river is a symbol of the course of lives. Each of you sails down as a small boat, so you need a boatman. If it does not for your own boatman, you surely go aground. This boatman really means your mind. If your mind makes a mistake, the boat breaks into pieces by a large rock. And you also need a bamboo pole. This pole is the meaning of the two words. When you go down a rapid stream, you need to punt in a stream. Then you can change your course. The true words means the teaching of Buddha. Buddha enlightened and spoke the true words, and Buddha's teaching became a gold mine. This gold mine suggests various teachings. These are another expression of Buddha's truth. It brightens up your days. Or to put it another way, the fruits of Buddha's mercy. All of you, now, here, Listen to me. Never lose your way, now and forever. The guiding hand has already waved. Please follow this white hand and go straightly on and on. Your lives are not limited to this world only. They have three aspects, the past, the present, the future. Your past have already gone by, yet still, your mistakes will be kept in your minds. That is the reason why you should understand other people and you yourself should reflect on what you have done. You and others are not different. On the contrary, both are children of Buddha and brothers and sisters. Now then, love each other. Let us bring up each other and it's time to forgive each other. This is the eternal law, which penetrates the present and the future. Yes, indeed, the light of the dark night. The dark night of this world is hell. It is also the same in another world. Since we came down to this world, the sun of the truth is scheduled to rise. Now we are watching rising sun, it will shed light to the future, to invite sad people to Buddha land. Now, here I command, there shall not be conflict in this world. There shall not be distrust in this world. There shall not be crime in this world. There shall not be evil spirit in this world. There shall not be the devil in the next world. Only the ideal world, utopia, shall be realized. All of the people love each other, live harmoniously, believe in one another. That world is utopia. All of us could be the light of bodhisattvas. Believe in that the light has reality. Believe in that love has reality. Believe in that. The truth has reality. These are the facts that should be conveyed. We, the light of bodhisattvas, get together, work together to keep right mind and live in tune with Buddha's words. Here we vow to do so.
prayer to the Lord. Our Lord El Cantare, you are the source of all light, all power, all wisdom, and all love. May you give us light, give us power, give us wisdom, and give us love. O oh Lord, our Father, please protect this planet of love earth. Protect us from all evil and open the future for us. O oh Lord, thank you for giving us light. We give thanks from the bottom of our hearts. Prayer to Guardian and Guiding Spirits My Guardian and Guiding Spirits, deep inside of me, you are the fountain of life, the light of hope, the source of wisdom, and the shield of courage. Every day, may you help me develop my soul and refine my mind. Every day, may you give me inspiration and show me the right path to follow. Please protect me from all evil and guide me in living a better life. For this, I give my thanks. Okay, thank you for joining and have a wonderful day.